Hey guys, hope everybody's having a fantastic morning or a fantastic day or a fantastic evening or a fantastic night. Today I wanted to talk about one of my Finch knives and one of my favorite Finch knives and that is the Finch Doc Holiday. The Finch Doc Holiday was one of the first Finch knives I brought into my Finch nest. It was one of the first Finch knives that was released. Um, this one is in OD Green Micarta. It has the Finch logo, which is a, a loom. Um, let me grab a light real quick. Bright light, bright light. So the shield will actually get a little loom there. That comes from Spencer's partner, Austin's partner, I forget, um, who came from the knife business. And then you've got titanium bolsters, um, kind of a modern traditional knife with a flipper with some nice jimping um, on the blade and this particular version is a Warncliffe. The Doc Holiday is a Warncliffe blade. Um, all Finch knives are in 154 cm steel and then different materials from micarta to G10 to uh, this bolster lock design that employs titanium and other materials from carbon fiber to bone to just a bunch of different materials. Finch, what Finch is doing with the knife game and the type of knives that they're putting out, they've really are, are suited for somebody who likes knives, who likes collecting knives, who, let's be serious guys, my Finch collection does not get a lot of hard use. I use it to cut things around the house. Um, I use it to play with, to flip around with, to, uh, you know, I use my little Runtley as a box cutter, as a package opener, but they have fantastic action. To me, they've got soul, They've got just a unique place that they fit in, in, in my collection. Titanium clips on almost all of them. And we'll run through the finches as we kind of go through the collection. But this is the Finch Doc Holiday. Uh, when I'm recording this, it's a Wednesday for Warren Cliff Wednesday. And I think it's just a great blade. I think it's a great knife. Um, medium, large size hand. You can see that I can get a good comfortable grip on this knife. With that blade that's very sharp and pointy it's a label cutter it's a cardboard destroyer it's all those other euphemisms to talk about how well it cuts it'll even cut you or cut me if we don't respect it so let's do a couple of quick size comparisons against some knives that we might all be familiar with we'll start off with the cold steel 4 max which will dwarf our finch stock holiday and let's look at it next to the Civivi Baby Banter, which it is going to be a larger than the Civivi Baby Banter. Now let's look at it next to the Benchmade Bug Out. Just about the same length as the Benchmade Bug Out, guys. That means it's gonna be smaller than the PM2 by quite a bit. So I would say for an easy length comparison, similar to the Benchmade bug out, and I'll have specs in the description. One of these days I'll get a ruler and I'll keep it out here and we can talk about numbers and I'll bore you even more to tears. But anyway, that's the Finch Doc Holiday. Love the knife, great little knife. If you haven't experienced a Finch, they're not a budget knife. They're not a high-end knife. They kind of fill that void anywhere from on the low end, $90, $125, $145, and up to $199 for the new uh, Buffalo Tooth. But it's a great knife. Uh, most importantly, please look out for the guy or gal to your left. Please look out for the guy or gal to your right. Look out for one another. Go forward with love in your heart, a smile on your face, and know that I love you all. Thank you for watching the video. Thank you for checking out my channel. Peace.